Today I am so excited, I am going on an animal adventure roulette. And we're here at Ambika Conroy's Ethical Fur Farm. She has a whole collection of Angora rabbits where she brushes the rabbits and she uses their fiber to knit into really warm knitwear to keep you warm in the winter. And then after that, we're gonna go to the New York Wolf Conservation Center where we're gonna get to meet some wild wolves. Are you excited, Petey? Can we go now? So we're here to learn about the rabbits, but I see you have a lot of other animals here too. I mostly do Angora rabbits, but I also raise Merino sheep and Angora goats, which is mohair. Um, and I make uh, what I call my house blend, which is 33% bunny, 33% sheep, and 33% goat. A luxurious, bouncy blend. Object. I think we should go look to the rabbits, but after that, we should go to the ghost again. <laughs> okay. This is the bunnies, right? What do they do? Well, other than be very cute and hop around, they grow beautiful long hair and they're super fluffy. And you can use their hair to make these. Are you going to take all the rabbits out? So, can we take one of the bunnies into the house and see what you do? Yeah, you want to? Yeah. So what do you mainly do with these guys? Um, I shear them. You can just trim it off. How do you spin it into a long yarn? I guess you put it all together. As you take these brushes, which are carters, you want to align the fiber straight. And then you're going to transfer it from comb to comb. Then you roll it off, look. And these are called roll legs. Then you have these all and you can spin it. How do you spin the spinning wheel? I'll show you. And then you can make it as thick or as thin you, as you want it. Like I could just do all of this and make a super thick yarn. What do you make with the Angola rabbit wool? Do you make crochets? Yeah, I crochet things with it. So I make hats. You try it on. Now put it on. Now pull it down. Are you ready to go to the wolf sanctuary? Yeah. We are here at the New York Wolf Conservation Center, which is in South Salem, New York, in Westchester County, and we're going to learn about wild wolves. Are you excited, Petey? so much for allowing us to come and check this out. Can you tell us a little bit about the Wolf Conservation Center? Well, the Wolf Conservation Center is a uh, not-for-profit, and, uh, and really the most interesting thing about it is that we're currently home to 21 wolves. And what we're doing here at the Wolf Center is we're really a marriage of, of uh, recovery and also education. So we have three um, wolves that we call ambassador wolves, uh, Zephyr Aleoa, who are behind us, and, uh, and also Atka. And these are the wolves that help us educate people about why um, their wild kin are important on the wild landscape. We're giving um, people of all ages, but especially this age, a chance to, uh, <laughs> to kind of leave their own environment and, and feel like they're in a totally different place. Thank you so much for taking the time to talk to us about this. It's such an amazing place, and I can't believe that it's so close to New York, and I never knew. Can you help? What are you guys talking about? I don't know.